I'm Chaitana Nietzsche, the coordinator for the ceremony. And parents and students have been receiving a lot of emails from me. And I'm so thankful that we had a beautiful ceremony today. And it is my pleasure to thank all the people who have been involved in the ceremony. I'd like to begin with Swamiji and Vilasini Ji. Thank you very much for your guidance. And thank you to uh, Aniket. Usually we have a, an uh, Acharya from uh, Virginia, Priya Ji or Rahul Ji, uh, come here to bless the graduates. And they could not be here today because they are busy. So Aniket very nicely stepped in and uh, gave us the translation so beautifully. Thank you, Aniket. And uh, Swamiji's uh, Thursday class. They are just amazing, wonderful. Thank you for that beautiful chanting. Just amazing. <laughs> and it, it's okay to clap. I think it's nice. I, I will overrule Swamiji. <laughs> <laughs> if you're clapping, we can't hear what she's saying. So and then, you have to stop. Still yes, I will. I will stop. And then I'd like to thank Anup, Anup Kumar. Anup Kumar, I have known him for a few years now. I've never heard him speak except on YouTube, and some of you may have heard him on YouTube. It was very, very beautiful to hear your thoughts on the genius and the revolutionaries. And I hope the genius and revolutionaries are in the older people also, <laughs> not just in the younger people. Um, and we have a, a lot of chicks here today, not just chicks who helped out, but a lot of alumni. So can you all please stand? I'd like you all, every chick who's here, to please stand. And thank you so much for coming to encourage our life. Okay, I'm going to call out the names of the chicks and the Balbihar children who helped us today. Please come and stand at the Shiva altar and we would like a picture of you all. And uh, after that picture is taken, uh, go to your seats. But I'd like to request you all to go back to Shiva altar when Swamiji announces the Arati. The Arati will be led by the chicks. Neha, I'd like you to lead that together with all the chicks. And the Brahmarpanam also will be done by the chicks. And Neha, can you please do the Brahmarpanam? And the Neha, thank you. Okay, here we go. Names of the chicks, Ajay Ravichandran. Harsha Nisha, Neha Mehta, Rahul Dharmavarata, Sambram Srinivas, Vikas Bector, Siri Nisha, Sanjeevini Mukherjee, Balivina, yes, I think she may have left. I'd like to thank the Chinmayam teachers for their support in interacting with the graduates to prepare for the event and the parents for encouraging your children to send their biodatas and articles for the souvenir. And the souvenir, you know, we prepared, so we started this 13 years ago, as Vilasani ji said, it was 30 pages. And today, if you open your souvenirs, it goes to almost 60 pages. So the number of graduates has also grown. We have a number of graduates on the, ro on the roster, as you saw today. And wonderfully, so many of you have shared your thoughts in your articles. So thank you for that. Um, I'd like to thank every person who helped out in the ceremony, teachers, parents, there's a whole crew of people. And if you go back and see the pictures from the past 13 years, you will find that the Tilak ceremony pictures are like a replica from one year to the next. And that has been possible only because of the dedicated volunteers. Thank you very much for that. And thank you to the Bomakanti family who sponsored the souvenir this year. And we have a very special person, our photographer, Ron Coronaldi. 
graduates for sharing all your very wonderful touching memories making us laugh smile and maybe even tear up a little bit thank you for coming and making this occasion beautiful for all of us hari I'll give a big applause to all of us. So, I prepared a half an hour talk. <laughs> Lucky for you, I give only a link for it. So, the link is the YouTube refer Gita chapter 3 verse number 30 the talks by the famous swam dhirananda <laughs> is in the youtube so refer verse 30 so i give a sneak peek of that verse came for this year's chapter mai sarvani karmani sanyasi adhyatma chita sani rashi nirmam bhutva yudh sarva jara that's how they tell about brahmarpana meaning and all so you know that verse so that the gist of that verse is sans selfishness sans means without sans selfishness sans fear sans selfishness sans fear march towards the light of your goal When you are marching towards the light of your goal, you need not be anxious or worried whether success will come or not. When you are marching towards the light of your goal, success shall follow you, chase you like your shadow, isn't it? So, sans selfish, sans selfishness, you know, but sans fear is an acronym. The fear, F E A R, represents F feverish, E excitement or nervousness. So, feverish excitement, A anxieties, R. regrets so feverish excitement in the present anxieties for the future and regrets of the past so sans feverish excitement anxieties and regrets march towards the light of your goal success follows you in fact will chase you like your own shadow so remember that if you want more like this only a sneak peek i'm giving the refer youtube verse 30 chapter 3 330 refer now we'll have the prayer and aarti and then we have the upamar so please stand face the altar